how much do you think it pains like Teresa and Melissa to have to just do this show year after year together? <laughs> do you mean, is, so the question is not pain to do the show, but it's together. Yeah. Is that? That's my question. Unless, um, you know, I'm being shady and they really get along and love each other. Um, I think, that, I've said this before, I think they're two of the same kind. I you think said it really in our are, earlier but, interview, um, yes. Yeah. So I think either one of them would love to bump the other one off uh, in a heartbeat and be, the, the thing is though, Melissa doesn't have a big, and I'm saying this, I'm going to say she's very great. Melissa doesn't have as big a star as Teresa. She just doesn't. She never did. I know she wants it. She wants to be the main star, and she's not. She was always under Teresa. You know? Teresa always had the main storyline, always had, um, she's just, she just, did. she's got the production behind her more. She's got, she's got everything. And Melissa was always second to her. I mean, you could even say, you could even sh uh, see it like how media takes Teresa's stuff, not Melissa. Melissa's not really seen. Am I right? I mean, am I correct when I say that? I mean, I mean, I think if you, you think I, no, I mean, I think if you went down the line and said, who was the first person you think of when you think of RHONJ, past or present, I think Teresa would be. 99% of people's answers. I'm not who you like the best or whatever, just whose show is this? I think maybe 99.999999% would say Teresa. And Melissa was just always in the shadows of that. You know, if it didn't have to do with Teresa, there was, you know, it was connected to Teresa. It was always about Teresa, you know, and, and, and Melissa's kind of like that after all. And I'm sure that that bothers her because Melissa wants to be the star, but she didn't catch that star. Do you think like Melissa is still here all these years later because of Teresa? Yes. Absolutely. Yeah. Do I think Melissa could carry a show on her own? And answer me no. Absolutely not. Well, uh, Teresa does have an entertaining quality to her. <laughs> Let's call a spade a spade here, <laughs> right? Well, as why as why watch her, you know? Yeah, I mean, I have to say, I might have forgotten that somewhere along the line, and like this season, I mean, yes, it's in editing, yeah. and they they do music in the background, but yes, yeah. this season, I'm like, oh wait a second, this is why everyone loves Teresa. I get it because. She d is going from zero to 100. I mean, I just feel like someone pulled her aside and said, and I'm not opposed to this, but I just think someone pulled her aside and said, it's a pandemic, we got nothing here. And you better just, remember Teresa from back in the day where she flipped a table? Sweetie, yeah. you see this million dollars is 1.5 here? You better go earn this shit. You better fucking turn it up this season. That's right. to me what happened this season. Now there is some changes in like the executive producers and stuff too that oh, behind the scenes. That. Well, Dorothy's not there anymore. Oh. I didn't know Dor now, Dorothy wasn't around when I was there. Oh, that's oh, right. She wasn't. No, I never met her. That's right. So I'm not yeah. saying that's why. I'm just saying that, like, I really feel knowing these people that someone said, well, because also either that or Andy Cohen was getting the dailies because, like, first, I mean, like, Orange County was filmed in COVID and it was horrible. Then Dallas was filmed next what? and that's not having such a great season. Then Atlanta, believe it or not, Atlanta isn't even so great. I just think by the time they got to Jersey and COVID, someone said, you better figure something out or just it's a different production company, which it is and they just know what they're doing. I don't know, I just feel someone said, turn it up girls, turn it up ladies. Yeah. Because it's like- They did. They did. They did. Yeah. Like everybody's fine. It's even Melissa, I have to tell you, Melissa, Melissa's not even, Melissa's not as buttoned up anymore where, you know, she's always worried about her image, right? She always, always worried about her image. Um, and she was very calculating. And I feel this year she's less calculating, which will, by the way, help her. 